Now, we have teed up a great assignment for our roving reporter, Matty J, this morning. Yeah, yeah that's right. Narelle there, our good mate, Matty. Uh, where are you, buddy, and what's happening? <laughs> Heat up. I love that. Guys, I'm at one of the most prestigious golf clubs in Australia. This is the New South Wales Golf Club. Mm. I've snuck on in, in in here, looking the part, obviously. Someone who didn't sneak in this morning is Jess. The uh, oh, Sorry, guys, I have to be quiet for just one second. Um, Phoebe's about to tee off. Very and we're not allowed to talk when she... Oh, oh, very God, smooth. Keep, keep your head down, Phoebe, on the next swing and, <laughs> and you'll be fine. Uh, Jess, you're the founder of the Australian Women's Golf Network. What does the network do? Uh, we're a group of professional business women that meet once a month and we play at some of the most beautiful golf clubs in Australia. And why golf? What is it about this sport that you love so much? Oh, look, you just have to have a look around. It's absolutely magnificent here. We're out in nature all day. Um, the business networking opportunities are just amazing and it's just a great group of women that we get to spend the day with. Now, why did you start this network? I'm assuming that you spent a lot of time playing this sport. Yeah, so I work in construction, so I was invited to a lot of professional golf days and obviously I couldn't play golf, so I thought it was about time to get a few skills and we, we hosted an event for International Women's Day, which was amazing, and we invited 20 women along and it was just such a great success and everyone said, when's the next event? And I thought, OK, well, we'll start running a few events for women. Well, you've got 22 events throughout the year. The yep. next event in Sydney is going to be when? Uh, March for International Women's Day, so it's going to be here, which is absolutely, you know, number one in, in New South Wales, and we're so privileged to be able to play here, especially as beginners. Look, I, I do love this course. It's yeah. my first, first time here, um, but I wanted to show you just a little bit of what I okay, can do, great. if that's okay. If yeah, you want to sure. take the mic. Yep. Just, uh, I've come prepared, guys. So uh, I actually, I, I, I did play a lot in high school. Oh. Um, so just want to, Maka, I would step back if I was back. you. I win the hips, mate. Oh. Wow. Yeah, take your time, <laughs> take, Sorry, take your time, time. take your swing. time. Oh! oh. Wow. Uh, that was... Probably uh, needs a little bit of refining, but, you know, we can, we that can was, work on that. That was, was fun, actually pretty good. It was a good start. It was a really good and start. Any other tips for me today playing golf? Um, well, if we just have a look at this. So the first rule is no denim. Oh. No hoodies and your cap turn that way and you probably need some nice white socks. Yeah. Uh, guys, this is a little bit awkward. Um, okay, I am... Do you have a spare uniform by any chance? Uh, we could probably organise something. Okay, so I'm going to get changed. I'm going to meet with one of the professionals. So when we come back, I'll be doing a far better job than just <laughs> then. Mm. That's... Uh, Mm, sorry You've got to about keep your head that. down, apparently. Is that what you have to do? Yeah, it's a dangerous day if you're a worm out there. I think you're going to kill every worm on the course, Matty. But keep your head down, mate, and you, you will improve. Make sure you listen to the ladies. They've got all the advice. It's a collared... You've got to have a collared shirt, don't you? Collar, yeah. belt and white yeah. socks, by the sounds. Yeah, I... J okay, can I just say, duty? Duty stitched me up. He, he didn't tell me about the dress code. <laughs> I've, I've rocked up. And, uh, Duty, if you're watching at home right now, I know you're on holidays, but, mate, thanks very much. That's okay, Maddie. This will be your last cross.